eight more days to go until the release of StarCraft II Wings of Liberty. Eight. That's five plus three. That's awesome. Beta ends today. Bittersweet, honestly. It's like a seed. You know, when you plant the seed, the seed is destroyed, but out of the seed comes a tree. You could look at it that way, philosophically wise. Beta's been a wonderful tool that Blizzard has used to uh, calibrate the balances of the races, and it's also been wonderful for us to be able to play it, this long-anticipated and awaited sequel to the greatest RTS game of all time. I'm just going to come out and say it. StarCraft is one of the best PC games, video games of all time, and the best RTS game. If you don't know what RTS means, it means real-time strategy. It means building an army from these mechanical bases, having minerals, or having an economy come in and destroying your opponent with that army using strategy. Eight more days to go. Uh, with the beta ending, to, ending today, I do have enough stuff to keep me occupied within that amount of time, within the week and a day amount of time. Uh, I have the Dark Templar Saga to finish, and it's pretty good so far. I'm more than halfway through the first book. I've also ordered the, I believe, the War Pigs comic books about a group of uh, mercenaries out to get Jim Rayner, and the number zero comic book of that series is released with the collector, collector's edition of the game. The anxiety is almost palpable, and the reason is because we have waited for this game for years. And when it was officially officially announced, I can't even talk right. I'm so um, a total mind grenade that is going off in my mind. It's amazing. Um, I've used that word a lot ever since I saw Inception. The announcement of the game was in 2007, and it's been over 1,000 days since the announcement. So we have been waiting patiently to know what's going to happen. And now that that date is set solid in stone, all this anxiety across the entire globe of gamers that have played the first uh, game is super concentrated because we're getting so, so close. So we're so looking forward to it. I'm really looking forward to what's going to happen on the propaganda site, what the 100% is going to be. And as soon as I find out, I will post it uh, on Facebook. And maybe I'll post my review of what the whole propaganda thing meant to me and, and the kind of uh, interesting connection it made between artists of the community and how they could present it to all of us in anticipation of the game. So Blizzard, if I had a time machine, I would use it right now. That's how excited I am. Awesome.